Oscars were filled with hilarious moments, emotional acceptance speeches, and some incredible performances. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your Oscar night recap. The event kicked off with an incredible performance of the nominated song Be Alive by Beyonce from the film King Richard. The songstress performed live from a tennis court in the Williams sisters' hometown of Compton and was joined by her daughter Blue Ivy clad in a tennis ball yellow outfit. It was such a moving and beautiful performance. Great way to start the night. The show was of course hosted by Amy Schumer, Regina Hall, and Wanda Sykes, and the trio of female comedians kept the laughs coming throughout the night. Amy Schumer went on to call out her friend Jennifer Lawrence for gaining some weight this year, referring to her pregnancy as well as praising Leonardo DiCaprio for his environmental work, joking that he will be leaving the world a better place for his girlfriends who are notoriously younger than him. Later in the show, Regina Hall brought her own laughs when she called up some of Hollywood's most eligible bachelors to the stage and then gave presenters Josh Brolin and Jason Momoa a pretty intense pat down. Some history was made during this year's Oscars with Ariana DeBose taking home the Oscar for Best Supporting Actress for her portrayal of Anita in West Side Story, making her the first openly gay woman and Afro-Latina to win an acting Oscar. Fan favorite Troy Kotzer later was awarded the Oscar for Best Supporting Actor for CODA and made history as the first ever deaf actor to be nominated and win an Academy Award. The moment was incredibly emotional while the audience waved their hands as Troy took the stage, which is the ASL sign for applause. The cast of Encanto, joined by Megan Thee Stallion, Louis Fonzi, and Becky G gave an electrifying rendition of We Don't Talk About Bruno toward the end of the show. The cast of the Oscar-nominated Disney movie opened up the performance and then Megan Megan Thee Stallion took it away with a remix of her own, freestyling about Oscar night, hyping up Zendaya, and showing off her gold Versace gown. It was truly a highlight. Things got a little crazy towards the end of the night. It all started when Chris Rock came out on stage to present an award, and while he was standing in front of the audience, he took a random dig at Jada Pinkett Smith and her bald head and army green dress. At first, Will and Jada, who sat close to the stage, both laughed, but within a matter of seconds, Will was up on stage walking towards Chris. And once they came face to face, Will seemingly slapped the comedian. As Will went to exit the stage, Chris said, wow, Will Smith just smacked the crap out of me. When Will returned to his seat, he continued to yell, keep my wife's name out of your effing mouth. Chris quickly said, I'm going to, okay, but most of the exchange was bleeped out of the live telecast on US television screens. We're not entirely sure why Will got so angry, but it might've been due to the fact that Jada has alopecia, which causes her baldness, and the joke didn't sit well with them. Well, later in the night, he won Best Actor, and a teary Will took the stage to apologize and said, love will make you do crazy things. I mean, that was pretty damn crazy. We'll have to keep you updated with all that's to come from this, but be sure in the meantime to hit the sub, like, and bell button for all the latest news on your favorite celebs. And don't forget to follow me on social media at Ali Stegnita. Bye, guys.